Hey you guys, welcome to your weekend edition love and general readings. This is for fire signs, sun, moon, and rising for the weeks of October 5th through the 7th, 2018. Um, so I have already shuffled and cut the cards. Let's go ahead and begin here. I want to thank you guys for liking, sharing, and subscribing to my channel. I ask that you all please continue to do so. Remember these are general readings, so they may or may not resonate. Um, if you want to book a private reading, you can email tomajtarot at gmail.com. Uh, make sure to check the description box below for how to reach me. Uh, also, please, you guys, uh, make sure you're not calling my 1-800 number until I make an announcement on here that I'm taking calls. Um, I haven't had times, especially since starting work, like the my weekend is booked up doing orders and the readings for you guys. So, um, yeah, at some point I will take on the calls again, but not right now. Um, so if you want a reading, you have to book a, you know, a video reading. Um, okay, so central issue, heart of the matter, we have the page of wands. We have the devil. The king of cups. We also have the knight of swords. Queen of cups. The father or the emperor here. We have the high priestess. And the five of wands. So for fire, there is a lot of fire energy going on. I'm seeing a lot of temptation. Um, somebody can't help themselves. Somebody has been trying to fight off some sort of attraction uh, or some sort of desire. Whatever your vice is that you've been trying to avoid or stay away from. It can be a person. It can be a uh, Drugs, alcohol, smoking, eating, you are being tempted, especially in that department. Y'all see that? Look at this person talking about it. He ready. I'm ready. They talking about they ready for you. And you like, mm, okay, I see you. And y'all like, let's go somewhere dark where ain't nobody, can't nobody see us. So I'm seeing for some of you, that's not a good thing because... Well, I ain't going to say that. For some of you, it could involve be because someone is already involved with someone or in a relationship. Um, and you're doing something in the dark. Um, you guys are definitely coming together. Look at this guy is running towards her. And she's ready and open. Literally. Maybe my mind in the gutter right now. But yeah, it's happening. Stuff is going on. Um she is channeling this person. They heard the call. They are running towards this person. There's so much. I'm, I'm just seeing like a lot of fire and passion between two people this weekend. Um, those of you with um, fire in your chart, if this is what you've been wanting, you know, good luck, you know, because it's, it's really coming out. Um, Someone, though, they can be very possessive and controlling. It's like once you let this person into your life, it's going to be hard to get rid of them. So be careful if you decide to move forward with this person. This person is is um, thinks of, you know, th this person doesn't play. Um, they are very protective of their love interests and will do heinous things to prevent anybody from coming in between them and their love interests. Um, this person is talking about, you know, having children. And um, the only other thing, though, this person may have like a temper, temper flare ups or a bad temper. They could be easily provoked. Hmm. There's a lot of passion going on. I'm seeing so much passion. I'm seeing father, mother, divine masculine, divine feminine, father, mother. She's drawn, she's channeling him. He he can't fight off this feeling. And there's all these secrets going on. You guys have a secret with somebody, or there's um a secret. I feel like it's more than attraction. I feel like y'all actually doing stuff. It's like forget talking and flirting. Like, uh-uh, this is going down. Um, so I feel like you guys have a secret with each other. 
this person is very seductive, very mysterious. The the if you're the woman, this person this guy finds you very mysterious, very attractive, or the, the one who's the masculine energy. Um, they're very attracted to your mysticism. They are turned on because you are come off maybe a little crazy and emotional, and they're like, oh, them crazy girls got that good, that good, good, you know. So um you know, somebody is like really drawn to that. They're like, oh, you do you do that spell work? You gonna put some voodoo on me? I'm seeing like a lot of <laughs> playfulness. You guys are like having fun with it. You guys are milking. I feel like everything coming out of my mouth is just wrong. Even that last part I just said. I don't know what's going on. Maybe I am Leo Rising, so I don't know. Um but yeah, there there's definitely frustration going on um so those of you that's just like look none of that dirty stuff is happening to me then what is going on is that you're still dealing with some sort of temptation here and you're you're secretly carrying out these things in the dark um you know whatever your vices are um, if it's spell, even for some of you, I'm seeing spell work, not that that's a vice or whatever, but I'm seeing spell work. And, and for some of you, it is about practicing dark magic and causing conflict between people or causing conflict in your home. Or if you, and this isn't happening to everybody. Anytime I mention magic and spell work, please don't go off saying, Oh my God, who is doing this to me? This is only happening to people who already in that lifestyle. So you already know people who do this. Um, you yourself are into this. Only people who are already dabbling in this and know people or have associates to do this. This does not happen to every regular uh, uh, everyday people. So, you know, I always have to reiterate that. Um, and people talk about, oh, I'm so scared. You know, it's like, look, it's not happening to everybody. Only the people. If, now, if you do know some people to do this type of stuff, yeah, I'm seeing somebody who is doing something in the dark. Either someone is causing conflict with between you and another person or you are causing conflict between them and another people and another person. Um, or somebody could be trying to bind you and, and draw you to them or they're doing this to you. Or both you and your um, your significant other. Um, what is that? I don't know why. It's like you guys are. It is like the high priestess and uh, a bruja. Is it a, called a bruja? Um, I'm getting something like in regards to sen, senda. Oh my God. I know y'all going to comment. Those of you that know what I'm talking about. Um, oh, a scent or something. It's some sort of, um, it's some sort of, um, you know, practice of magic or, you know, I don't want to offend anybody, you know, but it's like witchcraft or whatever, but I just can't think of a full name. I just know a scent or something. And I'm feeling like somebody is like literally doing that even as a couple. Like you guys are into that. Like that might be what drew you guys together. You're like, I'm so into that. Um, like both of you all might be playing around. Like I put a spell on you. He's like, I put a spell on you. Like whose spell is working in? So <laughs> there's like this playful energy with you guys. And you're connecting with someone who you have like a very strong chemistry to you. For some of you, this person could be coming just like out of the blue. Um, I don't know. It could be any sign because a lot of the elements came out. We have water, fire, air. Um, I'm not seeing earth, but that, um, yes, I am shadow Capricorn. Um, so yeah, all the elements are coming out. It could be, it could be anyone that you guys are dealing with. Um, before I go, let me go ahead and clarify the shadow card, although I, I feel like I already know, I already know what's going on. For some of you, it is about belonging to an organization that practices something dark, whether you know it or not. 
whether you're aware of it or not. Your organization is hiding behind a, a mask. Um, and there's something dirty going on. Um, it could be sexual harassment. It could be um, sexual favors. It could be something that is something that is done in the dark that is also dealing with lower energies or lower vibration here. And we have the 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 emperor clarifying uh, the shadow card. So someone is trying to do something for control. Like I'm seeing either someone is the leader of uh, of something that does stuff like this, um, that or the, is the leader of like a, a a government job that practices bad things or politics. A politician. Uh, someone could could be covering up things that happen in a life of politics or the life of Hollywood. It doesn't matter. Somebody um, could be covering something up. Um, but someone who has it's someone who is also maybe abusing their power. Um, also, this could be about, like I said, somebody trying to use. Uh, magic or sorcery to control you or a situation or maybe it's for your job maybe it's not necessarily for a person maybe it's just like look I need this job I need to secure it so I'm gonna need my boss to shut up so I'm gonna do this and that and that um, or you know you're getting rid of somebody at your job you're like maybe this person is trying to knock me out of my position I need to you know take care of that so I don't know it could be something going on either way someone is really just trying to control efficient and I'm also getting like fear tactics here um, there is someone out there that wants to dominate air and this happened again and I'm seeing too mm, I'm seeing um, more than one party involved like where's the loyalty um, I'm seeing too much temptation for somebody I'm seeing a lack of loyalty here there's a lot of parties involved is it's all these look at all these um, court cards that came out there's a lot of people involved in this so especially this could go back to belonging to some sort of organization or a large group of people or a corporation or a political party um, that's all practicing something unethical um, and in regards to relationships I'm seeing somebody is just really not being loyal to you or you might not be loyal to somebody um, because they're like I, I see what I want and I just gotta have it you know I just I can't say no I'm just drawn to this person it's an intense um, attraction temptation I, I I gotta have it so you guys um that is all that I am picking up for you um hopefully or maybe not <laughs> you don't want that to resonate but um thank you for watching anyway um, remember to leave your comments, like, share, and subscribe. Many blessings to you all. I'm going to pray for y'all.